The burial mass of the late Professor Victor Wifel gathered different people from different places as the Reverend Father, Most Reverend Augustine Obiora Kubeze, we conduct the mass, talk small about Vitor Wifel dream and how it takes start. He can't add, say, Vitor Wifel need to go rest for many things from this world. He can't advise people, make them learn from Vitor Wifel, may they not give up for their dreams. He never gave up on his dream. Age was no barrier for his achievements. He had the will to be great. He had the passion to achieve his dreams. And today we are here to honor him because he did not allow anything to stop his dreams and aspiration. We can learn from him from we can learn this from him. Never to give up on ourselves and our good dreams. We could learn also from him that we are never too old to be great. May I greet especially all the alumni. The children of the late professor still come out to make their tribute to their papa and contact the governor of Edo State, the people of the Edo State and Nigeria for their support. For the years we had our, with our father, Victor Efosa Waifu with us. Some of the late professor friends, we talk say Victor Waifu, a great man, we get time for everybody plus say, a legend for life and ego remain legend. And as you can see, we play the same instrument. He has been a great musician, but even more, a wonderful human being. He had time for any musician, unknown and known. May he be in heaven, play his guitar and play his flute. I give him a little improvisation. He played guitar like no one else. Like no one else, I repeat, I play the guitar. But when Victor Waifu picks up the guitar, I stop. I don't play the guitar anymore because I'll make a fool of myself. I just came in from Lagos where we shut down the whole of Ikeja on Tuesday in honor of the king of Sasakosa, Titibiti, Ifosa, you name them all, a proud son of Bini Kingdom and indefatigable African superstar, a world beater, and all the musicians of Nigeria from the legendary Ebenezer Obey to all the smallest, we shut down Ikeja because of the son of a do state who has passed on. And I've been asked to come here and say to you that you had a great son and that in life he was a legend, in death, he will remain a legend. I thank everybody who has come here to take today to celebrate with our brother and our friend. And uh, as I go back to Lagos, I'll carry the great message of uh, the Archbishop, which is that if we do the right things, Nigeria will survive. Thank you. Meanwhile, the governor of Edo State, His Excellency God, will not say we round off the barrier mass. Talk say, in time, the people will join them, come past the last respect of late professor. He say that the era of Vitor Waifo now produce good generation of people with poor mind for entertainment. Meanwhile, he comes the ad say, the Edo State government go name the newly built Edo State Creative Hub after the late professor as tunnel and then go launch the hub this November. Our newly constructed Edo State Creative Hub will be named after him. This creative hub, which is going to be commissioned during the second week of November this year, has a multi-million dollar soundstage for production, 
for artists. It will promote creative arts in Edo State. It has an editing suite for digital content, including animation. It will incubate state-based groups and artists. It will be used for live shows and stage plays. Artists from Nollywood to come and rent spaces for their productions. And there will be space for developing skills in the creative arts. That is the least we can do for a man who changed the face of music in Nigeria. That is the least we can do for the man who composed the song Jurumi that was the first song from Africa, from Nigeria to win a golden label at the time it did. People will attend the burial mass now. Edo State Governor Godwin Obaseki, his wife Mrs. Bessie Obaseki, Deputy Governor Philip Chaibu, former Governor of Edo State Adam Sochomole, and many others. Joyce Alohan for Obalan TV. <laughs>